first connect your flip video to your PC, you will be asked to view your flip camcorder videos using the program provided on the device. Here I've already installed the FlipShare program. Double click the FlipShare icon with your flip video camcorder connected and your videos will appear in separate windows. At the bottom of the screen you will see the icon for Save to Computer. I would recommend saving the videos on your computer. Once saved on your computer you can rename and edit the videos. You will be asked whether you want to remove the videos from the camcorder after saving. I will leave it unchecked and delete the videos later. Once saved, a new folder with the current month will be created. This one is named August 2009 and says there are nine videos in my file. If you double click above each video, you will be given the option to name each video segment. I would recommend naming all of your videos to make them easier to find later. On the top right side of the screen you are given viewing options for the videos. You can clip or edit each video segment either to eliminate an awkward camera movement at the beginning or end of your segment or just to shorten the video. On the bottom right side of each frame there is a scissors icon. Double click on the scissors icon for the segment you wish to edit. You will notice a start and end indicator under the frame. When you grab the start indicator and move it forward you will notice the number of seconds into the video also increases. When you move the end indicator the number of seconds decreases. Locate the points where you want your segment to begin and end. You can then save the trim video into your current file or click Save As and save it into another file leaving your current file unchanged. I will click Save. You can continue and edit all of your video segments if you wish. If there is a specific video segment or segments you would like to share with others, you can click on Share the bottom of the screen. There you're given the option to share your video by email, create a greeting card, or post your video online to MySpace, YouTube, or others. If for fun I select Greeting Card, you will see there are many creative frames within which my video will appear. If I select one and click Next, I am given the option of adding more videos to my greeting card. Pressing Next again, you'll be asked to fill out information and email addresses you would like to send the video, and then you would click Share. If I just want to share my video without embedding it into a greeting card, I simply click Email in the Share menu and 
fill out the information as before. Let's say I want to do something more elaborate than just send a simple video segment. Flipshare gives me the option to create a movie with my video segments. Click on Create, and from the Create menu, click Movie. A new window pops up. From here you can drag your video segments in. You can even rearrange them in the order you want. Once you are satisfied with the order of the video segments, click Next. Here you are given the option to add simple titles and credits to your movie. You can preview your work and then press Next again. Here you are given a variety of music options either using Flip Video's music or your own. You are also given the option on how you want your music to play on your movie. I'll check bouncing around and have the music play only. Click Next and you are given the option to name your movie. I'll stick with Carthage Library. Click Create your movie and Flipshare goes to work. You can follow the progress of your finished movies by an indicator in the bottom left of the screen. Once completed, you can click on My Movies, double click on Your Movie, and play. As with the video segments, you can also share your movies with others.